When I first started working on a design for a hydroponic rail system, one of my goals was to make a system that could grow plants from seed all the way to harvest. I didn't want to maintain a separate system for starting seeds with separate lighting and a separate water supply. So to achieve that, I designed the rail connections in my rail system to control the water level in the first rail so that it reaches the bottom of the net cups, allowing the seed plugs to stay moist for germination. To conserve space, the holes are drilled as close to one another as possible. This has worked really well. The only disadvantage is that it can be tricky to drill the holes close together with such a small tolerance. Recently, I worked with Chris from Prince and Prince YouTube channel to design a seedling tray that could fit into a rail. He came up with a design that could be 3D printed as flat pieces and then assembled. He printed them out of PETG and shipped the flat pieces to me. Using a rotary tool, I cut out a rectangle from the top of the first rail in my hydroponic system. This took some tweaking to get the hole size correct, but now the seedling tray drops in and the water level is just high enough to cover the bottom of the tray. This tray was designed to fit the seed starter plugs that I like to use. As you can see, this tray holds eight seed plugs, but takes up much less space than eight net cups would. When the seedlings have sprouted, I use a small metal rod to pull out the seed plug and transfer it to a net cup to continue the rest of the growing process. After the first prototype, we made a slight modification to add a lip on each side to block light from entering the rail through any irregularities in the underlying rectangular hole. If you are interested in 3D printing this seedling tray yourself, or if you'd like to buy one, I'll include links down in the description below. If you're interested in other 3D printing hydroponics projects, check out the Prince and Prince channel on YouTube. He's got quite a few other videos with ideas of things you can 3D print for hydroponics. Also, if you want to learn more about this rail system and how to build it, check out our website or our online course.